this is my way of applying please don't laugh hello guys and welcome back to my channel I will do for the first time in this channel a face routine basically after shower I clean my face and today I will show you what products I use how I use them and yeah I don't use many products just a few but it's, it's helping me so like and subscribe and without further interaction let's get into the video hello again so how I said in today's video I'm gonna show you how I clean my face if you want a close look, you can see that I have pimples everywhere. This, the chin, is my trouble area. Take a close look. Yeah, you can see a lot of pimples everywhere, especially when it comes that time of the month. Hashtag all girls know what I'm talking about. So, yes, I'm not doing any specific products which will get, well, basically, will make the pimples disappear because. There is no such magical product. I just do it to make my face look fresh, clean, and yeah, basically this is what I'm doing. I don't wear makeup because I don't like it. I know that with some foundation, mascara, and everything, I can basically fix all of this and no one will see it. But first, I don't go out that often. And second, I don't want to spend money on makeup, so... Yeah, without other talking, because I can talk all day, let's go into the video, this time for real. So the first product which I use is this baby here. This is Blemish Clearing Cleaner Freshing Toner with wheat extract and aloe vera. It's daily, you look how much it has left. Don't worry, I have another bottle. So before I start, I will quickly tie my hair, because, oh, this is... I don't want hair in my face and yeah, this, I'll do a quick messy one or whatever this will turn into, I don't know, just something that can help me, okay, not the best, but it looks better, I don't know why, but it looks like I'm wearing mascara or something like makeup on my face, I don't, I use my mouse on which he doesn't use, basically it stays at home, it's not mine. Uh, for a TikTok yesterday, I didn't upload it to my drafts, but I cleaned my face with water, even with soap, but it still looks like I'm wearing something, I swear I'm not, but anyway, so I'm applying this onto current, it's a little purple, I don't know, can you see it, and just start cleaning my face, literally, it has a bit like alcohol, so watch out when you're going to your eyes and nose because you might smell but i swear that it cleans my face very good i wouldn't do it on my chin because it's getting the only reason why i'm not cleaning my face in the shower is because i'm not careful with the water and i don't want water shampoo uh, or whatever i use to go into my eyes and that's why i'm doing it after the shower so if you think that my face is not dirty you are incorrect my face is dirty so now let's go to product number two so the next product which i use is this this is by planet spice korean charcoal cleanse and fine with korean charcoal it's deep clean face wash i don't know are you supposed to clean this with water but I clean it with the same cotton, which I cleaned my face just because, well, the beginning I was using water, but now I'm, I'm too lazy to go and wash my face. So I don't know a proper way how to apply this, but I just, I just use this way, my fingers, because I don't have any like mini spatulas or whatever people are using. So, this is my way of applying, 
please don't laugh if you have a specific way or anyway how to apply this you can feel free to comment I don't just like getting messy so to be honest I don't even know how much you have to apply just like how much I feel like it's enough for example this is and now I just clean my finger resting because it's going under my nails and now I will just clean my face with it like probably if you think that you have to stay some time with it no you don't just literally clean your face now I'm switching the sides of the my cotton in I don't know why, but for me, cleaning is satisfying, removing this. Sometimes I don't even clean it like good, so there are leftovers. But I'm trying my best, to be honest. So, yeah, I think. Think that I clean my face. If I look a little black, I'm excusing myself. And yeah, I have to say that it's it's helping me. I don't see drastic results, but this product is very good. And yeah, I recommend you to try it if you haven't. Product number three, which I'm using, is another product by Plant Spa. This is the Freshness Ritual with Himalayan. Moringa, it's a cleaning mousse. I had one mousse before, uh, one woman gave me, but it finished and I decided to buy another one. This is 150 milliliters, but I swear it looks like there's a lot more in it, so I like to shake it before I use it. It's, if you don't know what is a mousse, it's, well, it's like that. I mean, I don't know how to, it's like when you use your dish soap, so. It is making like little bubbles. I don't know how much is enough, so I just put how much I feel it. There is literally no recommendation how much you have to you have to put so apply as much as you need so I'll do it all over my face. This for me is you know how you can see it doesn't there are no stays on your face and so yeah it's, it's just pretty refreshing it feels soft a bit so yeah if you know any idea how to get rid of all these pimples which i usually have comment down below i would love to hear your opinion about this and the last product which i use to complete my face cleaning routine is this little box this is blackhead cleaning liquid extraction strip basically this is for my nose i haven't used this in a while i have to say that it's a bit painful so if you don't feel like it you don't like painful things just don't don't buy it don't use it so this is my i don't even know what bottle anymore it even has on the top because i haven't used it in a while so I use my finger to apply it, I don't know proper ways to apply so put as much as you need, it's a thick, you need to put a thick layer. I'm squeezing, I don't even know how much. Okay, I think that this will be enough and now all you do is apply it to your face like this. Maybe I'll put a bit too much, I'm not sure. Be careful with your eye area, so yeah, to be careful how and to not get into your hair. I had these struggles before, well, a couple of times, and now I learned to tie my hair because, well, bad experience. This is all I'm gonna say. So, and now all you have to do when you apply this is to wait 20 minutes for this to dry then you can peel it off if they're excess you can wash them with water i usually peel everything off and don't use water so my dirty fingers so 
I will wait 20 minutes and when this thing is done, I will show you the painful way of removing it. So uh, see you after 20 minutes. Bye! Here we are 20 minutes later, so now it's time to take this off. Most of it has completely dried and it's ready to be peeled off. There are some of it which is still like a bit liquidy, but it will come off easily, I hope so. So let's start the peeling process. I will take it, you can see how this looks. It's starting to get in painful, so this might take a while. Oh my god. Yeah, here's some of the excess which I'm trying to remove. It hasn't dried completely, so... Okay, this might not come as smooth as I thought. I have tears in my eyes because this is hella <laughs> painful for me. So, um, yeah. I'm saying painful a lot of times because uh i'll say it again if you're not used to these things just don't do it don't call it pain intentionally i'm sure that there are other ways in which you can clean your nose without this turn into something very painful so yeah actually this game fast than i thought literally way faster so these are your remainings. Literally, I didn't put too much, but it was enough. My face now feels a bit cold from where this mask was, but it looks fine. I have to say that I also used some face mask, which let me show you what I have. So I keep all my face mask in this box. It was from Candy, but it finished, and I said to keep the box. So let's do a little breakdown. So the first two masks, which I'm gonna show you, this is a peach one. I thought it's peel off, but it's not. And this is a peel off. This one smells really good. I bought from a shop called DM. You can search it. Basically, they were two face masks of this and of this kind. They are eight milliliters each. Uh, you can see it says here. 2 for 8 60 milliliters. I already have used them. I have to say that I'm very glad that I did. They're really good hair max. The next two I already have used before and I bought them again because they just did a very good job. This is a Millstone Glow peel off mask and this is Flow Glow peel off mask. The blue one is for pore minimizing and this is for illuminating. Both of them feel very good. And it's not painful at all. I thought that since it's a peel off, it might get attached a bit of my hair or anything. But no, it was so nice to take them off that I didn't want to do it. Or basically, I wanted to repeat it again. So I recommend you. These are from the same store which, in which I bought my hair products, which I showed you in the last video. It's Lily. So you can search them. The next masks are Galaxy Diamond Bleeder Violet Mask. It's a peel off. And I got a twin. And this is the same Galaxy Diamond Glitter, it's blue mask. Basically, the this, the purple, was the last one, so I got, I guess, got lucky. I haven't used them, and I don't know how they work, but I'm pretty sure that they do a very good job, so I'm happy to try them. And the last one, which I get, it was actually a present with a bunch of other products. It's a Snail Repair Silk Mask Pack. It's pure essence. That's a huge bag, it says that it's 25 milliliters, so I feel like this is a lot of product, but I haven't used it yet, I got it last year, so I better use it before it's expired date, so um, yeah, I saw this, it was $3, so yeah, maybe I should try this one, because it's my first one, which I have, and... Yeah, basically never tried anything by snail, so that will be a really good experience. So this is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Comment down below if you have a face routine. Do you take care of your face? To be honest, I think that I should do it more often. But sometimes I'm feeling lazy and like, ah, I'm gonna do it the next time. And I keep delaying it. And as you saw my pretty face, no the sarcasm. Uh, I have a lot of things to work on, basically, to make it more clean, 
and maybe I should buy different products than this which you show in this video so up to now I don't want to spend much money because I spent a lot of money here to be honest and I don't want to make it like an obsession base in hair because I'm still not working so I don't want my own money and even if I did I don't want to spend way too much money on certain things so for now focus on my hair my face well I'll do it part by part keeping up with the face mask and cleaning it hope that everything will turn out good one day I have to say that I didn't have much problems with my face when I was a teenager because I have seen many people with some even dealing with me and I have to say that this thing is horrible I never had it but I have seen pictures and I'm very glad actually to have such a clean skin I mean it's not perfectly clean but compared to other people I feel very lucky to have this type of skin and to be honest I didn't take care of it at all like from a long time basically I started taking care from like one two years so you can see it anyways because I keep talking a lot and a lot so like and subscribe and I'll see you next time bye